Uh, oh, I can get to the participant list on my phone. That's great. Okay. <laughs> okay. So I will welcome all 10 of us to <laughs> the Tuesday, September 6th mm -hmm. meeting of Soquel Creek Water District. Um, the first order of business tonight is to do the um, roll call, and then we will be going into closed session um, from 6 to 6.30, and then back here um, at the public session at 6.35. So, Emma? Roll call. Uh, Director mm -hmm. Daniels is absent. Vice President Christensen? Present. Director Jaffe is absent. Director Lather? Present. And President LeHue? Yes, I am here. Thank you. All right. So we will be back um, at 635. Hey. And um, President LeHue? Yes, ma'am. We have a raised hand for public comment prior to the post. Oh, great. OK, awesome. Um, go ahead. I can't see them tonight. Well, and like it looks like Director can. Jaffe just joined, so I'll promote him as well. OK. Great. Well, yeah, I didn't, I, I can't, I, I usually on my computer, I can see any raised hands and stuff, but I'm, I Ms. don't have that ability right now. We'll Ms. Steinbrunner, you're unmuted. Thank you. This is Becky Steinbrunner. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Thank you, and good evening. I hope you are all staying cool in these, these warm times. I want to, um, I want to just say as you go into closed session to discuss in part the litigation that I'm still carrying forth regarding the Pure Water SoCal project and it's all of its modica modifications that um, I, I did ask for um, and was given mediation at the last case settlement, uh, case conference meeting. And I see now that um, your council is suggesting that this mediation be vacated. And I, I frankly do not understand that. It would be in the best interest, I feel, of the district and of my time and resources to try to work this out in mediation. And therefore, I, I take great exception with what um, Ms. Schiller is trying to do here by setting another case management um, meeting in this month. I was not consulted to see if I was even available for that time. And um, it looks to me that it is a move to try to scuttle any attempt at mediation. And I want to let you know that I support the mediation route. And I guess my time is up. But I, I support the mediation route. I think it will be best for all of us. Thank you. Thank you. Any other public comment? This is Bruce Daniels. I'm online. Oh, great. Hi, Bruce. Great. Hi. So um, I'm in Ashland right now. <laughs> Oh, well, good for you. Um, All righty. Um, so we are now set to leave and go to closed session, and we will be back here at 635. Is there anything I have to do to follow you there? Good to go. Bruce, you there too, Jaffe? See you there, but I don't. I'm, I'm here. OK, awesome. Great. All right, well, welcome back, everyone. Um, we um, just came out of a closed session where we discussed the all of the items listed 1.1 and 1.2 um, and no recordable action was made. Reportable action was made. Sound, pro sound correct, Josh? Uh, yep, perfect, thank you. All right, um, we have no public hearings tonight um, and we have um, on, on, on an opportunity for board members to remove any items from consent. So. And, and Dr. LaHue, I'd also like to make a comment after the board members. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm looking. I don't see any hands raised on the board members or removing items, but maybe I'll just ask just to make sure. Bruce Jaffe, you have any? 
No items to remove. And Bruce Daniels. I have nothing either. Carla. Oh, muted. Uh, uh, I reviewed it and I don't have any that I feel we need to discuss. Okie doke, and Rochelle? I'm the same. Okay, and then do we have any public comment on the consent agenda? I'm looking for hands myself. There's a hand um, raised, so um, that would be, this would be the appropriate time. Miss Steinbrenner, you're unmuted. Good evening, this is Becky Steinbrenner. Can you hear me? Yes. Thank you. Um, I would like to first speak about item 4.8, the um, monitoring or background analysis uh, baselines for the Pure Water Soquel project. I am very happy this work is being done. And I would like to respectfully ask that um, the scope of work also includes sampling when permission is given at the um, nearby private wells and small water systems. The Pine Tree Lane Water Mutual, the Bluff Water Mutual, and there's some private wells that are very, very close and downstream, if you will, of the Twin Lakes Church Injection Well. I respectfully request that the scope of work include also sampling those wells. Um, I would like to ask that any and all um, analysis of, and data from this be made public. And I request that um, Soquel Creek Water District submit to the public a final anti-degradation analysis for the Pure Water Soquel project that will assure the public under Rule 66 of the state drinking water law, uh, there seconds. has been no final um, anti-degradation. I also want to request that um, under the item 4.5 that um, conflict of interest be considered as your directors also serve on other agencies. Um, Director Lather did sit as chair of LAFCO and made uh, votes uh, over the county water. Your time uh, is up. Okay, is there any other public comment on the consent agenda? I don't see any hands raised. Okay, and um, any motions to uh, Dr. LaHue, if, if- Oh uh, yeah, I saw it. sorry, Ron, I just wanted to say something. Yeah, I just like to note, and I, I think council has said it doesn't need to be pulled, uh, just on item 4.7, uh, if that could be considered with, uh, the dates will probably change on that. So just uh, approved oh. with without having those dates specified. Yeah, that's We just got notified logical. today. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Okay. Um, any motions for the consent agenda? I would move the I would move the entire consent agenda. Uh, could could you? Uh, I wasn't at the meeting August sixteenth. Could you uh, vote on that separately, or am I allowed to just? You can just uh, you can just vote and just abstain on that item. Okay. No need then. And I'll just make one little comment just on the um, special board's assignment status report. Um, there's some of that stuff that is has been on there a long time and it's hard to pick out what's new and what's been there a long time. So if there's any way to highlight new things and make sure the dates are updated, that would be a more valuable document. Thank you. Okay. All right, so it was moved by Bruce Daniels and then Bruce I'll Jaffe. second. Oh wait, Rochelle second, okay, got it. Yeah, I think Bruce was wondering about voting. Got it, okie doke. Um, so roll call please. Director Daniels? Yes. Vice President Christensen? Yes. Director Jaffe? Yes, except for 4.1. 
He's yeah. abstaining from 4.1. Yeah. Thank you. Director Lather? Yes. And President Lehew? Yes. So now we move to oral and written communication. So this is a time for anyone who wishes to comment on items not on tonight's agenda. Um, I'm going to guess we'll have a hand raised, and yes, we do. So let's go ahead. <laughs> Ms. Steinbrenner, your mic's available. Thank you, and hello again. This is Becky Steinbrenner. Can you hear me? Hello? We yep. yep. Okay. Thank you. I'm coming on phone, so I can't see you if you give a thumbs up. So <laughs> I don't know. Thank you. I would like to ask that um, your agendas remove on um, page one, that you remove the part about the request to speak form. It seems that that is no longer the policy. And yet, because it is very prominent in your public comment for virtual board meetings um, language, many people may feel that if they have not submitted that request by 3 p.m., they would not be allowed to speak. And, and that is not the case. And I'm sure that you want to encourage public participation. So I um, respectfully request that that language about the request to speak form be um, omitted completely unless people want additional time, more than two minutes. I would also like to thank you for halting the um, Clearwater SoCal project conveyance pipeline on the Laurel Street Bridge to prevent harming the cliff swallows that are there. I understand that that only came about because um, a concerned member of the public brought it forward and um, the biologists agreed that having construction on the bridge in the summer months while those birds are nesting would be detrimental to them. So thank you for stopping that. And I did see in your construction notes that it will resume in September, but I respectfully ask that it be tied to and confirmed by a biologist that the swallows have in fact left. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Um, are there any other requests to speak? I don't see any hands raised. So any of the board members have anything they'd like to act, you know, add on oral communications? I'll, I'll talk for a second. I'll talk for a second. Go I'll, ahead, I'll Carla. address that. It does mention that on the day of the uh, the day that people may speak just by raising their hands or speaking up, uh, but we might as well take that section, the first section out of that. So that's probably, that was a good suggestion. And I'm glad to hear that uh, district is so responsive to uh, the biology and environment where we're working. So that's two, two comments that I thank Becky for bringing it up. Okay. That's it. Um, maybe one else. Okay. Let's see, I'm looking. Don't see anyone. Okay. Then we will go to reports, administrative business, and then adjournment. All in one swoop. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Because we we have no uh, none of those tonight, so we will let's see. We're meeting again on the nineteenth, correct? No, twentieth. Yes. Okay. So we'll see you guys on September twentieth, correct? Yes. Bye, right. bye, everybody. All right, meeting. Well, have a great trip. Thank you all. Thank you. Bye bye.